It's Friday night, so you know what that means. It's time for some high school hoops. I'm at St. Mary Catholic for the girls basketball game against Reedsville, a non-conference matchup. But first, there was a much bigger game over in Hortonville as the Polar Bears were hosting Nina. Hortonville came in with a one-game conference lead. If they can get the win, they can lock up the FBA. If not, they'll likely tie at the top. Polar Bears up two to nothing. Rainey Wilson doing what she does best. Just an insane spin move. Flips it up with her left hand and in. Plus the foul. Now only up one here. Wilson uncorks it from deep and it rattles on home for a four point lead. Nina trying to cut into that lead. Michaela Warner gets the swat and they're going the other way. Julian Martin will finish the fast break with two. But UConn commit Ali Zabel, she could be unstoppable. She gets the driving bucket. Then her teammate Rowan Klesman with a smooth J. Nina only down four. But Wilson just too much to handle for the Rockets. How can you guard this? Flips it up and in. Polar Bears roll 73 to 59 and have pretty much locked up the FBA with a two game lead. Now let's get to the game here at St. Mary Catholic. The 21 Zephyrs hosting Reedsville. Up two to nothing. Zephyrs Sienna Anderson dishes to Laura Ripley for the layup. Then the Panthers better guard Anderson. A three from the corner. Then how about back to back? She sinks the three from near the top of the key. Then how about another just a few possessions later? Zephyrs crew 64 to 30. From St. Mary Catholic High School, John Miller, NBC 26.